Hi everybody, thanks again for joining us here on the Geek Tech Industries live stream. Stick us here. Sally here. Sorry we're running a little late, some things came up, that's life, that's, but we're here, we're here to kick each other's ass. That's normal with us. Though. That's kind of normal, kind of par for the course, because, you know, it's not like we're professionals at this or some shit. We're often uh, late. Yeah, yeah. 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 So... Good job. Good job, G. Nice. Yeah. It's like a giant steaming mess all over the kitchen counter. Awesome. Wow, we're batting a thousand tonight. You bet. Killing it. Everything is coming up Millhouse. Everything's coming up Millhouse. <coughs> oh. Okay, so... Oh, hey, Jay. Thanks for joining us. Uh, hey, yeah, spoiler alert. Stickus will be betrayed by his dice and die horribly. Often. <laughs> Often, that is the case. Yeah. So we're... <laughs> yeah. We're, we're getting set up here. Uh, Bally and I are going to fly some probably some stupid lists. Um, I get the feeling I'm going to get ravaged by bombs. Oh, uh, I know. I know. So, uh, you know what? Just because of that, why don't you cover what you're flying first? <clears throat> All right. Well, I decided it's time for some good old Imperial flight action. Woo! So, I recently, and after a ridiculous amount of time since it's being released... Got around to picking up the TIE Interceptor standalone package. Oh my god, it's so pretty! I did that right before my, or during my Mario Kart ship X-Wing getting that all together craze. Thinking about that recently, we should get back together with that. Um, anyway, so I've never flown Suter Fell, so I figured I should probably get around to doing that <laughs> now that I own it. And I purchased an aggressor when it was released, and I've never, ever flown the Aggressor. In fact, you watched me take it out of its package today. Yep. The cards I had already taken out, but the ship itself was still in its For packaging. intensity. For intensity, yeah. right? Yeah. So, intensity, sink, turret, unguided rockets. So, anyway, I'm going to fly an Aggressor as well. So, I've got Sunter Fell with Royal Guard tie, push the limit, a shield upgrade, and auto thrusters. Awesome. Then I've got I like the idea of shield upgrade instead of stealth device. With he the needs bombs. that extra hit point. He needs that Those extra hit point. Those bombs are gonna hurt so much. Uh, then I've got uh, Lieutenant Kestel with adaptability increase. We'll get to that in a second. Lightweight frame, unguided rockets, and synced turret. And then the Countess Riyadh. Oh, Tyx Seven and Juke. My favorite pilot. Now, if you're looking at the cards that we have provided for you to look at, and the lists that we have provided. It seems to be reading that my adaptability increase is an adaptability decrease. It's showing as a minus one pilot skill level instead of a plus one. Kestel is this match at an eight yep. pilot skill. So we've got For the For some reason, technical difficulties are telling you guys otherwise, but trust us, he's at eight. Yeah. So when, when the overlay <laughs> comes up, you guys will see it. It'll say adaptability minus one, but his pilot skill will still be eight. So don't worry. We know. We know it's broken. Yeah. Again, yeah. par for the course. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. So that's me, Stickus. What are you going to bomb me with this week? Well, this week I'm going to bomb you with, wow, what a surprise, Captain Nim. Uh, so he's very similar to my previous Captain Nim uh, with um, the Havoc title, Genius, Bomblet Generator, Auto Blaster Turret, but this time Accuracy Corrector mm -hmm. uh, instead of Advanced Sensors. Oh, wow. Veteran Instinct, so he's still a 10. Mm -hmm. Long range sensors, so I can pick up target locks at range 3 or beyond, but not at range 1 to 2. And a cruise missile. Right on. Uh, backing him up is Fen Rao, kind of a standard push the limit Fen Rao. We got Fen Rao and Suntir Fell. Should this be is going to be beautiful. This is going to be beautiful. So, Fen Rao has the Concord Dawn Protector title, push the limit, and auto thrusters. Uh, and then Ankar Plot with Pattern Analyzer, Space Tug Tractor Array. Citraco Vizago, the wheeler dealer himself, and the cloaking device. I can see how this is going to go. I'm course. hoping. I'm yeah. really hoping. I do not have luck. Can you transition back there? Uh, I do not have luck at all flying the quad jumper. Every time I have flown the quad jumper so far, he goes, Oh, wait for me, guys! And gets left behind and dies. Or gets right into the thick of things fails to do what he's supposed to do, and dies. So, I'm expecting him to die. Yeah. And do his job. Yeah. 
I'm so, sure he'll die. <laughs> Whether he'll do his job or not, it remains to be we'll seen. We'll see. We'll see. So, uh, after all said and done, I'm at 100 points. I, I think I'm actually at 99 with this one. I'm 99. So, I will take initiative. Uh, and so I'll get started placing the debris. Um, Sheeny, if you would mind switching the overlay to the um, in-game, please. Is that what it's called? No. I forgot. It's been so long since you've done this. Uh, tabletop recording, too. Par for the course. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, it hypers us into the play field. Ha, ha, ha. Need a beta again. Ha, ha, I'm working on it, ha, okay? I'm working on ha. it. Jeez, nothing but cutting me down lately. Wait, it does this neat thing? That's great. You need to do more. Right? Right? Somebody couldn't even find the transition button. Um, where do I interact with the list? Uh, in Xstreamer. So if you alt tab, I'll show you. That is, ooh, yeah, range one. And range two. Okay. Got it. Not that one. Two. Because it has a window, another window that it wants. So. Okay. Um, I have a three, a nine, and a ten. You have a five, a eight, and a nine. So I will place Unkar Plot first. I have no idea how to place these guys. Do they fly together? Do they not? I just don't know. He'll come up over here. All right, Unkar Plot. Countess Riyadh, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give her a warm welcome. Welcome back, Countess. It's been a long time. We love you. Really, hardest working women in the Empire. People will say, how runner? Shh, how runner's got nothing. Nothing, I tell ya. She's got rerolls. What are you talking about? Not herself, though. I was really liking that, uh, that youngster list for squad leaders that I was putting in. Oh, The whole yeah. idea of just keep on everybody just squad leaders in action to somebody else. Somebody else. else. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, kind of shenanigans. I think I like it. I guess you shouldn't have placed it. Because oh, you're right. You're silly numbers and shit. I'm a nine. Um, I mean, just take that away, then. Take it away. Get it out of here. Well, now you can um, place it. Well, because now I have initiative, don't I? Okay, okay, I suppose. Doom, doom, to doom, 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 to doom. Uh huh. Perfect. Okay. Okay, I think I'm ready. Let's dial it in. Oh, I forgot how weird the quad jumper dial was. You have never had very much luck when flying that thing. No, I never have. I just... <clears throat> luck is definitely a requirement, I think, with the the quad jumper. I you need a lot of skill practice. and a lot of luck. And yeah. it helps if luck is one of your many skills. <laughs> That's true. Yes. Luck is not one of my many skills, unfortunately. I don't, I, then again, I don't really have like bow hunting skills or like quarterstaff skills or any of that stuff really either. So. Skill, 
Yes. It affects your skills. No, no. Luck is a skill. Luck is totally a skill. Yes. Cold. I'm trying to think of what uh, what exactly that line's from. I know I'm about to be really embarrassed for not knowing immediately. It, it's a thing. It's a thing. Why are you worried about your... What, Bal is Bally and get if Bally's afraid to embarrass? I just like to look and see what the chat is saying and see what She's people are saying. She's not worried about, about my, what I was saying. She's worried about what you're doing. All right, we're dialed in. Okay. Good luck, sir. Sheenie, if you'd start the timer. Sure. Uh, all right, I'm going to start with Unkar Plot here. Ah, uh, the scum. Come to collect their bounty. Well, you know, we actually came to salvage something here, but apparently uh, I forgot that Unkar Plutt is a wanted man. It's been a while. Do we hit the resume or the start? Button? Resume. Yes. Checking. And then you should be able to see it on the on the screen. So Unkar is going to do a forward three, and then uh, drop the ball. Uh, no, I'm going to cloak. Drop. I'm a gonna cloak. I can just figure out where the hell I put that dang cloak token. <laughs> so you go ahead and carry on, sir. Yeah. No, you need to put your token. I, I will. I, I will. But car carry on, Peter. All right. So I'm gonna go forward five with the countess. Oh, I put that dang cloak token. Ah, there. Cloak token. She's okay. going to take her free evade action. Yeah, go X7 title. And then I'm going to do a barrel roll. Do a barrel roll! I really want to fly an intensity countess just to see what I can get out of that. X7 intensity, I think, could be pretty freaking awesome. Shit, and it's even, not often that she spends all her tokens. I didn't even think about that because I built this list before intensity. Duke existed. is still OP, man. Could Duke swap is still Duke OP. for intensity, same price. Yeah. Um, you just got to make sure that you barrel roll all the time. Just an easy little forward two with the aggressor here. Not very aggressive, Mister Aggressor. Not very aggressive. He doesn't need to be. He's got turrets. <laughs> And rockets. He does. At least they're not rocket turrets. I'm not sure I can handle the rocket turrets. And he'll do a barrel roll. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess my nine first, because initiative. So I'm going to do a forward two with Bell. I'm sorry, Fell. Fen. <laughs> wow. It's because I, it's because I wish I had the balls to fly, Fell. <laughs> And uh, Fen is gonna boost. Beep. Um, and then it's gonna push the limit to take a focus. Okay, Fell is going to forward five. Mm -hmm. Going to do a barrel roll. Do a barrel roll. Um, then he's going to push the limit, which will give him a focus in order to take an evade. <laughs> yes! Yes! I love seeing that. Okay. And then Captain Nim is going to be like all like, forward four! Bonk. Yeah, I'm not really worried about it. God damn. Fly them Ship at different heights, so big. Man. Fly them at different heights. Oh, not no a bonk. bonk. No bonk. Not a bonk. No bonk. No bonks. Uh, he will attempt a target lock. Just 
out. So instead, he will focus. Okay, I don't think there's going to be any combat this round. Uh, Ten. Or, yeah, start a combat. Start a combat. You got no shenanigans that way? I don't think I... Uh, nope, I got nothing. Uh, you just measured. I know. Yeah. Oh, man. Nope. Oh, <laughs> like... Oops. Whiskers away. Whiskers away. Okay. Uh, that's going to be end of combat. Mm -hmm. End phase. I use the Traco to discard the cloaking device and replace it with a dead man switch. Yep. If I decloak, I can never recloak. But there's also no chance that my cloaking device will fail. Yeah. Until I choose to drop it. Phew. Okay, let's see. Where am I gonna put you, buddy? Where am I gonna put you? Okay, Phil. Where are you going, buddy? Jumper. Can you go? Where are you gonna go, Quaddy? Do you even know? With your weird ass dial and your weirdness. Hmm. Let's try that. And then. Or. Let's see, actually. Just go for it, Stickus. Just go for it. What's the worst gonna happen? Still gotta figure out. I haven't really ever flown Fen before either, so. Once or twice, but not really. Okay, you're good? Yep. You're obviously good. I'm gonna do a hard turn two with Uncard Plot. Should I get all up in my face with Riyadh? That's the hope, anyway. Uh, and then he's gonna barrel roll. that cloak token around with him like badge of honor Riyadh does a hard turn three you got this god damn it <laughs> she takes her free evade action Ankar's all looking in the rear view like god damn it I hate those defenders Countess. Okay. Kestel does a bank three. Mm -hmm. And we'll Oof. take a target lock. Your choice on who to lock. On Fen. Fenrau. Fenrau, ladies and gentlemen. Fenrau. Getting the target. Okay, Fen Rao. Mr. Bank. Fen Rao himself, Does ladies and gentlemen. A bank too. Mm -hmm. And 
gonna boost. Oh, son of a bitch. Nope. Ooh, not quite. That makes me kind of sad. Um, focus. Oh, and then good old... Nope. nope. Fen, good old... Good old Fell. Send your Fell. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do now. Oh, shit. There's a bank. Two... Yes. Yes. Yeah, uh, that's that's the barrel roll that I couldn't do is what uh, screwed me there. I thought I might have been barrel, able to barrel roll into here, but it was too far. I'm going to take a focus and push the limit into taking an evade, which assigns me a focus. Yep. I'm going to turtle hard. Turtle it up! Okay, and then Nim's going to get back on his post here. Back up there, Nim. Woo! He's got room. Stay posted, uh, Nim. Stay posted. Rip. Nim's going to forward four. Forward four. Uh, going to drop a bomb. I doubt. Uh oh. No, oh, he'll be out of range. Everybody will be out of range. That's sad. And then. Hmm. Focus. Okay, end of activation. Bomb detonates. No one is within range to be affected by it. Start of combat. Start of combat. You betcha. Start of combat. So, Nim has... Does he have that shot? Yes, he does. So he has a four dice primary that he can take, or I could auto blast her. I think, honestly, a four dice primary is a better idea. Although Auto Blaster would only give you two dice. Ooh, it's a tough call. It is. Although, no, what am I talking about? Auto Blaster, Accuracy Corrector. You have Accuracy Corrector. I mean, you can either guarantee two hits, or you can take your chances and try to go for the four. Here we go. Guarantee two hits, right? Accuracy Corrector into two. There you go. So, one and a two, two. Nine! Fen. No you shot. Got nothing. Okay, right? so. Like, no shot? No, no shot. shot. No shot, Fen. Okay, so you're going to have four dice. Yep. I also will have four dice because I am at range one of you. Yep. I'm range one in your arc, therefore I get one extra die. Oh, and actually. Uh, I don't get one from Concord Dawn because we have to be mutually in each other's arms. Yeah. So I spend a focus and to you turn get the one up. That's just two. Just two. Okay. And two of eights. Okay. Uh, Kestel mm -hmm. uh, checks for range with his turret. Synced turret. No good. So I'm going to take a primary weapon attack against three dice. Um, Nim. Ooh. One hit. One hit. Nothing fancy. Nim goes, well, I'll take it. That's cool. Very Nim's obliging. Off the shield. Very obliging. Oh, I figured. It's, a, it's the least I could do. Yeah, very obliging. Okay. Um, I have to admit, I'm Countess. a little annoyed about what you've done with Unkar right now. Well, Countess is going to be closest to closest is obstructed. It's range two obstructed. Yep. So three dice. Three what? My three On, dice. Oh, yes. 
And I get two. Two hits. Two hits. Okay. And I'll spend two. the focus. Oh, okay. And that comes down. And then and I'll spend, spend the focus. focus. Yeah. Encore plot, no shot. Sweep token, set maneuvers. Encore is not going to be shooting anyway. I hate you, though, man. Like, dang. Nah, you're going to, I think. Encore is going to be out for the game. You're going to trade this point. the shit out of me with your. Uh, with. Yeah. Yeah, he can solo if he does. If I do right on placement, I can hopefully solo you, but it's tough. Tough. I may as well be Tiny Rick, man. Thank you, love. You. Oh, I pushed the limit for a focus, didn't I? You did. I did not apply my stress. I was like, why don't I have a stress? Mm, man, that was. I wish I could have barrel rolled there. That would have been such a different fight. Yeah, I would have ended up barrel rolling back and boosting instead of super turtling. Yeah. And then we would have had a little exchange of exchange shots. Exchange there. But that turned out. Well, you know what I should have done probably was auto blaster then. Yeah, I'm yeah. surprised you didn't. I or yeah, like I should what, have done. What fell. care do you have for for my turtle for up when you're accuracy correctoring right through it? Right. For some reason, in my head, he was too far away. Yeah, I see. I know that's not true, but in my head, he was. Oh, here you go, Arthur. Oh, I know. Hmm, yeah. it's a thing. It's a thing. Damn, I don't really, I'll admit, I don't really know how I want to handle the Countess this turn. I mean, uh, that was some great maneuvering on my behalf last oh, turn. Oh, man, you're but, like, woo, 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 woo. But I didn't really leave myself with anywhere great to go this turn. You know? <laughs> yeah, it's true. Hold on, let me just double. Yeah. Let me overthink my maneuver with uh, Captain Nim here. Okay, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I think I'm good. Done overthinking. Uh, I've lost one shield on Nim. And That's it. And Kestel has lost. Oh, and Kestel shield lost and one home. shield and a home. Yeah. Thank uh, you, Auto Blasters. Okay. Go ahead, man. Okay. Here we go. Would you like to decloak? That's really tempting, but no. Can I do a turn one? Go. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Nope. So he will focus. Okay. So the much deliberated upon Countess mm -hmm. is going mm -hmm. to turn out. Am I crossing the rock? Oh shit! Yes, yeah, you are, sir. Well. No action, and you don't get your free evade. Oh. And I take a hit. Shield. Uno shield. That's not so bad. That could be worse. Okay. Um, okay and Kestel. Kestel is going to do a turn two. Oh, really? What? What are you doing all going over there? And he's going to take a focus. Okay. Uh, Fen. My Fen Rao is going to do a bank two. Uh, and then he'll shit his stress. <laughs> he'll boost. Ooh, whoop. Whoop. 
and then he will push the limit to barrel roll. There you go. They're all like, sup Ben, snuck up behind you buddy. So I'll do a turn two. Do you want to get behind him, really? Because I'm, I'm happy to see you back what there. What I want to do is, <laughs> is I want to barrel roll out. Yeah. There you go. Now you're cooking. And I think I'm actually just going to sit on it right there. Okay. Nim. Nim! Uh, when I reveal, I drop a bomb. I am already so tired of bombs. You know, the bomblet generator was just so great. Now, I haven't flown a single game since its release that didn't involve it being used. I know, right? It's kind of ridiculous. It's because everybody's my like, opponent. Eee. Just throwing that out there. Uh, You're my yeah, opponent. Well, considering all <laughs> I've flown for the last while is Nimgar. Uh, yeah, could you template Kestrel out the front? No, I can't. How, how about that? Can you now? No, I can't. How, how about now? Yeah, yeah, I figured it out. Okay. So I'm doing a Talon Roll 3. And I wasn't sure if I would fit, but I do. There we go. Uh, that's all on Castle. Yeah, he's dead. And Nim gets a gas and takes no action. Uh, that would be all maneuvers. End of activation. Uh, Fell is outside. Oh, you're just outside. That's who I really wanted to hit. And two dice. Then you could have um, dropped it after the maneuver. Still would have been too far. And put some on Fen. <laughs> oh, I'd love to put some on Fen. That'd be great. Hey, Fen, how'd you like some splash damage? Oh, that sounds Riyadh's like a great idea. Tip. Fuck. Okay. Luck. Man, Riyadh's got the best luck in the Empire, I swear. Okay. Start of combat. No shenanigans. So, two dice, auto blaster, into the castle, and it. correct two. it into two hits. Because I gotta roll dice. And then uh, Fen, uh, four plus one for his ability. Flat roll, I could completely whip him here. I gotta take whatever I get. Two hits. You well, get, you, get your three, you get your three dice with lightweight frame, and you have a focus, so. I spend the focus. Shit! <laughs> God wow. damn it. <laughs> yep, that's a thing. Hoo <laughs> thing. Okay, well. Wait, frame pan for itself. My only shot is that shot. <laughs> There's a chat here. Oh, ghost down. So I'm going to do my synced turret into fell, or fen. Okay. So I, I get an evade result from my uh, title, and I roll... Buy four dice. And I get to re-roll re as many die equal to my primary weapon value because you're an art. Oh, so, just two. so I get, so there's my evade result mm -hmm. from Concord Dawn. And two. So I evade all of it, thank goodness. No. Uh, Finn really is just a high-risk jester, isn't he? Yeah. All these it's, people are like, he's an art dodger. No, no, he's not. He wants to be in your face, terrifying the shit out of you. Uh, 
Yeah, okay. That's, that's the entirety of combat. Because these three got nothing, so I'll sweep my tokens. And Finn. Okay. Uncar Plut. Not like... I thought that dial looked weird. Yeah, that, that'll work. <sighs> Such a limited dial on the quad jumper. It's at least it's better than the hawk. It's just weird. Mm -hmm. Okay, just making sure I'm turning the right direction. Hold on. Yes, okay. Double checking your countess. Yeah. All right, let's do this. Unkar Plot is going to do a turn two. A turn two. A turn to where? The left. Uh, and focus. Okay. Okay. The Countess reveals a three, which she's going to K turn. Okay. I would say I'm surprised, but pretty much any time the Countess reveals a straight maneuver, if there's room to K turn, she will. She just does. Three evade. She'll take a focus. Okay. Uh. Castle. This guy is attempting to turn three. Let me... Oh, you'll clear it. Oh. There you go. Right there, sir. Right there. Perfect. It's perfect. And then he's going to barrel roll. Mmm. Okay, it's all you. Okay, um, Fen Rao is going to do a turn two. I was tempted to just blast him out and get him the heck out of dodge, and then I realized, wait, he's still fresh. He's a jouster. Keep him in there. Keep him going. So I shed my stress because that's a green maneuver. Uh, I will attempt a boost. Then I will push the limit for a focus. Okay. I will execute a turn one. Oh, you're going to come in and flank me again, you son of a biatch! I know if I can make the boost. You could have if you'd have gone from the backside as opposed to the mid side, uh, to the mid. Right, because I went from there. I don't know. If, I still don't think I'll make the boost. Uh, I think you will. You can at least attempt and it. And right? I'm going to push to boost. Oh, no. 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 Oh. You still got me an arc. So I'm going to push to evade. Which gives you the focus. Okay. Uh, oh, that followed Finn. It's over here. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. I'm going to reveal a bank two. And drop a bomb. Sheds my stress. I don't think it's going to be close enough to get anybody. 
Ah, nobody's close enough. But at least I can drop them. Um, hmm, I'm about to take some serious shots in the face, though, I'm sure. So Nim's going to focus. Okay, pop that bomb. Pop that bomb! Out of range. Out of range. Out of range. Nim's immune. <sighs> Nims first. Nims first. And the question is, do I go for the auto blaster shots on Fell, or do I try to clean off? I'm gonna measure. It's not really much of a try. I mean, yeah, you can auto blaster Fell if you want to put two on him, but um, you guarantee to kill Kestel if you shoot him right now. I know, but I know Kestel also can't shoot at, at uh, Nim. He's not a threat. So I am gonna two dice auto blaster and accuracy corrector into two hits against uh, fell. <sighs> Nine. I has no arc on fell and I have a range two yep. on the countess. So I'll take my range two three dice. Oops, that's grease. <laughs> Can't roll evade dice for damage, Glenn. Uh, that's at range one, if we're both at range one. Okay. Well, I'm glad I focused, because I'm going to spend that focus to turn it up. It. Mm, no, nope. you can't kill me outright. Spend it. Shit. Well, at least you spend it. And you lose that. Yeah. And also you lose a die. I did. And I just bounced off my foot. I have no idea where I am. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, so uh, Fell is first, and yeah, I'll take the four dice <laughs> on, <laughs> yeah. on Nim. Clean off them shields, yo! Uh, it, although it is, I mean, it's admittedly tempting to open fire on, on Fen. Uh, on Fen. No. Yeah, I'm gonna open fire on Fen. Checking for range on Fen. Range two. Three. Woo! <laughs> Three hits. Nice one, sir. Nice one. Uh, and oh Three shit! Hits. Fen's about to die. Quick. Fen's about to die. I should have just blasted out and come around. Maybe. Three hits. Let me shuffle that up a bit. Now Riyadh is also at range two. Yep. I was honestly hoping for range three, but it's a thing. Riyadh only gets one. That might be all you need, sir. Nope. Not this time. Uh, Riyadh's still fine. Fen has just taken three and has one hull left. Riyadh is only missing one hit point. Uh, Fen took two, lost a shield, and uh, one hull, and uh, has two hull points left. Okay, maneuvers. Yep. Sweep tokens. Sweep. Two hull points. Yes. Okay. He had a shield and three, so. Holy crazy! Where do I go? How do I get out of here? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh! Claw Jumper's like, wait for me, guys! I want to play, too!
All right. Okay, I'm ready. Are you sure? Probably. Would you like to decloak? You may execute your maneuver either way. I'm thinking about it. Let me just... Hold on, let me... In the hopefully someday immortalized words of Monty Python, Get on with it! Okay, my dials are ready. At the start of activation, yes, I am going to decloak, because, fuck, I just got to get him in there. <laughs> and you're like, yes, he took the bait, the sucker. That's what she said. Because, <laughs> fuck, I just got to get him in there. <laughs> All right. Uh, start activation. Flip. Activate and do right onto the rock. A turn one, not on the rock, you silly. Just really close to it. Just really almost onto the rock. Time to barrel roll, so the next turn isn't guaranteed. Rock. Right. Well, that actually gets me a lot further than where I would have uh, gone. Uh, you would have ended up approximately exactly right here from your turn, ready to perform an action anyway, but still yeah, close. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. No, maybe. Yeah, shut yeah, up. You so away. you baited me, you bastard. And it worked. Carry Beautifully. on with your bullshit. Beautifully. Carry on with your bullshit. Okay. Camus Riyadh. Mm -hmm. Bank one. What? X7 title and you're going so slow? No, that's what I'd have done. Keep on Finn's butt. And I take an uh, A. Okay. This hopeless case over here is going to do a turn two. Turn two! And then a barrel roll. Okay, indeed. Uh, my nine now, right? I'm sure you're shocked. I do a turn two. Uh huh. Towards Fell. Realize that the Countess is right there, and that I'm also really damn close to Kestel. Who, since you decided not to finish off last turn, is now once again a threat this turn requiring being dealt with. Sort of. Oh, yeah, bump my ship. Sorry. Bump my ship. Well, you know. I'm already facing a potential collision, <laughs> and you go and bump my ship. Cheat early, cheat often. So little, there's my barrel roll, and then I'm the going to be push the early. limit. What do you mean? Nope. So let's just do a regular boost. It's probably not going to be enough to get me into range one. But I had to chance it. Had to chance it. Okay, Fell. Fell is going to do a turn two. <laughs> I had to get away from her arc was the big thing. Mm, and he's going to do a barrel roll. Mm -hmm. Push the limit for an evade and get a focus. And, yeah, pretty much. Okay. Uh, ten. On reveal, I drop a bomb. Think Fell might be close enough this time. And I don't want to accidentally blow up Finn. So, and then I'm going to do a bank three. Got 
gotta stop flying in the same height as all your other ships. No, right? I'm just gonna fly in low now. There's Captain will be to focus. Okay. Uh, end of activation. The bomb explodes. One crit. Ugh. Console fire action to flip it down so you can spend the next turn to put your mustache out uh, got no shot okay so auto blaster into, start a combat oh, console yeah. fire what you just oh, put a console shit, fire man. on me dude at the start of each combat phase you're right at the end of, at the end I, of I, I forgot so. that that was the end of activation and not the start of combat yeah. okay um nim at kestel and accuracy correct it in the two hits. And we have the auto blaster. Yep. Uh, fan has no shot. Nice shots. Fell. Oh, not quite. No dice. And Rayad. Nothing. Okay. Um. He's no longer cloaked, so if he does have arc, which he does, does not. No, sir. Oh, it's so close, though. It's so it sure close. Is. Okay. Uh, sweep tokens and set maneuvers. There you go, sir. Uh, mm. Fuck, I don't know where to put Finn at all. I know exactly where to put Nam now. I think I know what to do with the quaddy. Hmm. Does it go that way? Okay, it's that way. Okay, so you're gonna do that, and then you got no choice, Ben. I'm ready. Quad jumper! Bank three. Okay. For when I try to burn my fell straight ahead and get out of there? Well, maybe. Maybe. Um, my action is to drop use the space tug tractor array and drop a uh, token on the countess and then barrel roll her over that's my ping pong ball trick Okay, so the Countess is going to bank three and slam right into Fell. I was hoping over the rock, but I'm happy with the collision in, in, in any case. <clears throat> and Fell is going to turn two. No oh, shit. I was expecting Fell to push out. I know. You can push the limit off the action on that console fire, by the way. That's good to know. So I'm going to console fire 
put the console fire face down and my pushing of the limit shall be to perform a barrel roll. What? Okay, uh, my Fen is going to do a turn two. So I'm just going to template my min here. Boop. Uh, he will boost. And then push the limit. You uh, templated your nim. Oh, shit. You're right. Shit, where... Where was it? I don't remember exactly. Good job. Good job. Hold on. Hold okay, on. don't move your dial. That was approximately right there. Oh, the yay, delay! <laughs> screen delay had you somewhere around there. Okay, good. Close enough. Close enough. Okay, and then I will push the limit to barrel roll with Fen. Oh God, please don't die next round. Okay. I guess last but not least. Oh, I had initiative. My Fen should have gone, shouldn't it? And then you fell. Yeah. It, it's kind of moot now. Three bank. Uh, and I will acquire a target lock on the canvas. Okay. Fire in time. Uh, no shots. Only one shot no shots. on the board right here. Range, Range three. three. Woo, I'll take it. Range three and clear. So here we go. Spend the focus. Hit and a crit. Hit and a crit. And wow, I bust out two of aids. That's almost impossible. What the fuck am I doing now? Okay, Fan, let's try that and try not to die, Fan Rao. Try not to die. Okay, I think I'm ready. Yep, go ahead. Uh, quad jumper is gonna do a turn one. Hoping that puts me close enough. Uh, Not for fell, but yes for the count. But yes, well, I was hoping fell. I'm gonna measure anyway. Nope. Uh, so I will put a tractor token on the countess and I'm going to barrel roll her Oops. man you are all hands today I'm so handsy right now putting you on that rock I'm just all hands Ugh. I'm good Okay, so the Countess is going to reveal a 4-3, which she is going to K-turn off of. Yep, she sure does. And thank you for freeing me of the potential stress. Because I was going to go right through there. And I was okay with that. 
Uh, now you I also didn't get, overlap, so you get your free I action. I also get my free evade action. And I will take a target lock. Oh, Uncar. Oh, Uncar. <laughs> Goddamn blobfish. You. Okay. Uh, I was used to you moving two because of Kestrel. Exactly. Fen is going to do a turn two, which thankfully is far enough. Um, he's going to... Boost. And then attempt a barrel roll. And there's like a millimeter of mat right there. Cool. And that was his push the limit, so there's his stress. And then, oh yeah, it's my turn. Oh, you're done. Fell does a bank two. Heads his stress and looks like. Oh no! Focus. At least you get a focus off that. Because you're gonna get another stress. Oh shit! Oh shit! Will that die? This is just not my game. Well, you've never flown. Because now I'm gonna. And no, I'm dead. Fine. Oh no, you're fine. Yeah. Uh, and then Nim is gonna do a Talon roll three. I think I'm gonna end up too far away to auto blaster you. <laughs> yeah, I think even there is too far. Uh, and then I receive a stress. Could have bombed me. Oh fuck! You're right. I could have. Ah! Damn it! I flew right up into your ass. Too. I know. I know. And I just. Oh well. Yep. So combat. End of activation, nothing happens. Combat. Nim is a uh, measure to the Countess. Just to see for shakles. Nope. Just inside range one. That's game. I'm done. You're done? Yep. Good game, sir. Whew. That was dancy. As soon as you got Fen to three health, I was just like, run away! Man, so you can't get all! So are you still going to try to extol the virtues of your advanced sensors over accuracy corrector? You know what? I figured it out. Advanced sensors works on Rebel Nim with the TLT. It just I, I, it works. It seems to work better with the twin laser turret and uh i think the accuracy corrector auto blaster on this is just like the go-to build now if you're not putting accuracy pr uh, corrector and auto blaster uh with the havoc title you're doing it wrong yeah he much. doesn't he almost doesn't need the bomblets with that he just needs to fly close to people and be like smash 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 yeah whoo Ankar, i was a little disappointed because he was like we you beat me without him. I know. I mean, he was, with the exception of two uses of the Space Tug Tractor Array at the end of the match there, he did nothing all game. I know. He cloaked up and he flew around in a figure He eight. tanked a bunch of... He, he soaked he a bunch of... He tank shit. No, no. He out. soaked a bunch of points he that, soaked was, a bunch that were of out of the fight. <laughs> he soaked a bunch of points off of your list yep. and ran the clock a little bit. <laughs> ran the clock a little, right? <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, fell... Is so unforgiving. The second you make a single mistake with him, he just goes woof and explodes I, I, in a fireball. I mean, I don't know that it was really many mistakes on my end. It's just you probably would have been okay if you hadn't overlapped there. No, I think so. No. You know Accuracy so? corrector killed me. I didn't uh, take shit from the overlap. Well, it stressed me, and all it did was cause me. Uh, but that's what I'm talking about, is if you hadn't... I know, I, I think if you hadn't bumped there, you could have gotten away. You still could have gotten out. You still would have shot me dead. And you... I can't believe you didn't drop a bomb. 
I should have. Oh my god, I feel like such a fucking dumbass. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Well, there you have it, folks. Nim uh, proving that he is the star of Wave Eleven yet again. Um, Finn, I thought did an admirable job, and Uncar Plat. I'm just gonna have to fly you some more and figure out what the fuck you're doing, buddy. You just need to fly him more into combat and less more. out of combat. Well, and your big the- mistake was assuming I was going to go straight forward with Riyadh thought... here, turning out of the fight, and that was it. You stayed out of the fight for four turns to try to get back into it. I know, because I expected you to come up and try to flank. Yeah. You should have. That is not at all the way it works. You committed this way and forced. Yeah. I should have. I totally yeah. should have. And next time, fly, him to, fly these there. two together. You got four four defense dice on that sucker. Get in there. Get in there. <laughs> get it on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Well, that was a lot of fun, so thank you for the game, sir. So, I think it's very obvious why it is that you see very... I mean, you do still see some, but you see very little Imperial lists in competitive. Because almost everything that Imperial fields are TIE Fighters, with very little in the way of hit points and very little in the way of shields. They're squishy. And especially now, with bombs suddenly like this huge meta... You Imp- can't compete. Imperial it aces can't. are done. It just doesn't Unless do they it. have a bunch of hit points, like a TIE SF or yeah. a Defender. Yeah. Don't even bother. I mean, don't the bring Defender can hit, carry on, because that's six hit points, three agility. That or... said, a recent store championship was won by four Alpha, or sorry, five Alpha Squadron TIE Interceptors with Auto Thrusters. So apparently the Interceptor's not dead yet. No, but you have to put a whole bunch of them out. You have to feel uh, an interceptor swarm, exactly. Yeah. Which, that's a lot of fucking attack dice in the joust. Yep. That's a lot of shit, man. 15 plus, depending on range. Right? Right? So, that's a thing. Yeah. Well, that's a lot th- of dice to roll. Thanks, guys, for joining us uh, for our first match tonight. We're going to take a short break, and then we'll be back again. We might change up lists. I don't know. We'll talk about that. Uh, don't forget, of course, to check out our Patreon, patreon.com slash geektechindustries. Pick yourself up some uh, Ewok insurance. It's a great deal. Really, some of the best coverage you can buy in, uh, these days. And, of course, this Saturday, uh, if you're local to Victoria, come on down to Everything Games. Uh, there is a store tournament there with FFG swag. So come on out and uh, earn your uh, alt art cards and some of the new tokens they got going out. I still have no idea what I'm actually flying when I go there, so... You did pretty good with this one. This might be a thing. Fen did his job. Fen did great. I don't know why, but you just can't seem to get the performance out of Dengar. Even though he lasts till the end of the match, you still end up not winning with him. With those lists, it's not the performance out of Dengar that is the problem. I go, herd a derp with Captain Nim, and he just falls apart. This game... I was just like, always get in, always get that accuracy corrector going with the auto blaster, and it that's was... just it. Your previous lists, you refused to use the accuracy corrector. You still had that damn advanced. The fan sensors is superior. Shut up, stick. Cause you're an idiot. Yes, I was and an fan idiot. Fan sensors is the way to go. I'm rolling my <laughs> dice for auto blasters. I got a miss and a crit. Fuck. Fan <laughs> sensors aren't helping me anything now. <laughs> that was me crying over my fan sensors. <laughs> uh, advanced sensors are dead dead to me uh, so those of you guys watching on the archive don't forget to like and subscribe leave a comment let us know how we did if you liked what we did if you didn't like what we did uh, and of course we'll be back in about half an hour or so uh, with another match for you sounds reasonable Bally you got anything else I hate bombs you hate bombs I'm just <laughs> Putting that out there. Just throwing that fucking out Fucking hate bombs. Fucking hate bombs, man. <laughs> yep. So tired of it. <laughs> I mean, I, I've used them. I've thrown that bomb with generator out on the field a good few times, and I've had my fun with it, too. But Your Nim and Ray was... The shepherd Ray. That's a force, shepherd man. Yeah. That's a force. But yeah. Um, yeah, I'm so tired again of having to deal with bombs every match, every turn, every time you try to do anything. Oh, hey! There might be a bomb here, but there might be a bomb there. (laughs) It could be over here. It could be over here. Who knows? Or Stickus could just forget to drop it. That is a thing. That is a thing. You know, like, remember the fucking card, Stickus. Remember this fucking card. You know what I'm going to do on Saturday? 
when I go out to the tournament, I'm going to get Sheenie to paint a big bomb explosion on my hand, the back of my hand. So that way, every time I reach down, there's my reminder to explode my bomb. So, right on, guys. Thanks a lot for joining us. We'll be back in a little while. We'll see you guys next time here on the mat.